What's going on? You want to tell him? Yes. Yes, I do. Okay. A decision's been made about the promotional campaign. Well, we're going to be going with the Hollywood Glamour line, right? Well, we decided to go with something new, actually. Um, it's, it's something different. We're going in a different direction. What direction is that? It's called Hope. Hope for the future. Steffi's idea? No, it was Hope's, actually. Your daughter. Our new intern. It shows her idea over Steffi's. Uh, okay. I can see you're not really happy with this, but you know what? It's really a great concept, and if you just give me a chance to tell you about it... Ridge? Logan, I helped Steffi with that presentation. She believes in it, and so do I. But you and your sisters went to your teenage daughter's idea instead of Steffi's? What's going on here? Listen. This time, I'm afraid you've gone too far here. I've had enough. No, this is it. Brooke, I'm done. Finished. What are you saying? I'm telling you it's over. I just heard you. Well, what do you expect me to say, Brooke? Not that it's over. I knew you'd be disappointed about Steffi. Look, but I just can't take this anymore. I can't do it. This time, Brooke, you just pushed me too far. Mitch, please. You're overreacting. I understand you're upset, but... Do you understand why? You feel that Steffi's been slighted. Her campaign was great, Brooke. Yes, it was, but Katie liked Hope's idea better. So all this talk about being on the same team, forgiving and forgetting, loyalty and commitment, we've just been kidding ourselves, right? Well, it's not gonna work. What are you talking about? Are you just giving up? You can't do that, Rich. We've been through too much. Logan, I wanted to leave when Bill first took over. I stayed to protect my children's legacy, but if Thomas and Steppy are just going to be kicked to the sidelines here, what the hell am I doing? What the hell am I doing here? My kids don't have a significant role in Forrester creations, then I just don't want to be here. It's good you took a good, strong stand with Brooke. I just don't want Hope caught in the crossfire. Oh, this is about a lot more than Hope. Daddy, you so have to do something. Sweetheart, I'm so sorry for all this. Yeah, so am I. I'm sorry I took this PR spot. What's the point? All I'm doing is getting pushed aside. No, your, your father knows exactly how you feel. Yeah, it's bad enough Katie killed my campaign, and now she wants me to help Hope with hers? Forget it. I'm not teaching her how to do my job, because that's what's happening. Oh, come on. Hold on now. Katie hates me, Dad. She wants me out. Then why would she hate you? Because I'm a Forster. That's what this is about. It's an in-your-face to all of us. She has her sisters back on her side, and now she's using hope. It's all about payback, Dad. I'm worried about it, too, honey. You have every right to be upset. What Katie did to you was unfair. We have to find some way to deal with this, because my children are not going to be shut out. I'm not going to allow it. So you're asking me to choose your daughter over mine? I would never ask that of you. I just wish that you could give Hope a chance. She's a teenager. She has absolutely no experience. But she will learn. She's the demographic that we need to target in order to get ahead of the game. We all agreed that she has unlimited potential. You all agreed, meaning you and your sisters? Rich, I know you have issues with this. But please... Don't make this about the Foresters versus the Logans. It's hard not to see it that way, Brooke. I didn't start this war. 
Your sister did, the day she sat in Dad's chair and took over as CEO. It's been a battle ever since, day in and day out, defending my family, protecting the honor of this company. Katie has absolutely no respect for me or my children. My family built this company, not Katie, and not the Logans. It's hard to see the anger in your eyes when you say Katie's name. It's even harder working for someone that I just don't respect. You know how the stock is. Spencer's got a lock on ownership. It'll spare me all the reasons why Bill got our company by the throat. I know you just want him to disappear in a puff of smoke, but that's not going to happen. Logan, I only want one thing. Call me old-fashioned, but there's still such a thing as right and then there's wrong, and Bill Spencer should not be running our company. Or the Logans, for that matter. Mitch, we're all on the same side. Why does it feel like we're drifting apart, Logan? And what really matters here? I'm not going to let anything separate us ever again. Well, the battle lines are drawn. Unfortunately, it's your daughter against mine. Mitch, love is not divided. Our love, this company... Our children working together, that is going to be our future. And we're going to find a way to achieve that. Well, that's a beautiful dream. I'm afraid that's all it is. Look, I'm sorry, Logan. No matter how much you do the math, it's still family against family. Yours against mine. I just don't see any other way to change that.